All right, welcome back to dealing with Luigi. And when I say dealing, I of course mean he's the dealer and I have to deal with him. So yeah, uh, I'm actually streaming this in the morning for a change because this is usually the, the block where I had streamed Toho, but all I'm doing in Toho right now is just practicing fighting Moko, and nobody needs to see me practice that. So, I kind of got my, uh, you know, my half an hour of practice in for this morning. And so now I'm kind of bored, so I figured why not grind with Luigi? Because everybody loves grinding with Luigi. Come on, who doesn't love grinding with him? The grind is on. And Jose made a funny Xeno reference. Let me put the chat box in a better spot. There we go. I mean, I'm not getting the best hands right now. You could use a bit of a bit of a backup, Luigi. Come on, man. Anyways, currently I have um, five of Moko's spells unlocked. That's bit, that's as far as I've gone. I think she has like 11 of them, though. Is that correct? Yes, Food and Easy reference. I think Moko has 11 spell cards. So I haven't seen all of them yet, obviously. I've only gone like halfway through her boss fight. So, yeah, I've been just practicing the five that I unlocked yesterday. Oh, finally, I didn't get dicked over by that. Yeah, yeah look at me, it's the two Luigis. I make that, uh, still two Luigis. Yeah, I'm streaming this because I'm kind of bored. Um, coffee's not online right now, so I don't have a whole lot to do, sadly. I'm just kind of chilling. We're going to play Linguini. Linguini's Casino. It's not that I can't play Toho A, it's just I practiced a little bit and I said I'm good for now, so I'm going to just stop for right now. I might keep up the grind later. I might do I might grind I might grind out Moko's fight more later. But I uh, just I just practiced her spell cards and I did her stage a little bit. I couldn't really make any progress. So I'm probably just not feeling it today. I probably got to do better later on. Whenever I have the time, I guess. No. Well, yeah, since it is morning, that means I actually get to have my tea time during a tea time stream. <laughs> that doesn't happen too often. And I'm getting some godly RNG here. See, I wish I got this RNG more often. <laughs> Boo. Also, I think my Twitch forgot to update, so it's, it, thinks, it thinks I'm streaming for 14 hours. <laughs> Silly Twitch. It was basically picking up from last night's stream. Fuck. Yeah. Update stinks. Anyways, some. Well, speaking of updates, um, yeah. I'm hoping this week we get to play Metal Gear Solid 2. I'm hoping we get to play it on Sunday because that's the ideal. That that would be ideal, honestly. But apparently, oh yeah, I never told you what time, Jose, but apparently, I think we're gonna play Metal Gear Solid 2 around, um, 4 p.m.? Also, Luigi cheated again. You won't, you definitely won't get interrupted. I mean, at this rate, you just kind of have to accept the fact that you're always gonna get interrupted. <laughs> oh yeah, let's go, another full house. Is Luigi gonna cheat again? Okay, he didn't cheat, good. Might be able to get to 8k today, if I'm lucky. 
Yeah, see, no one, no one joining Zeo Saga allowed. That's not allowed. I mean, it's fine. I mean, uh, wait, Jose, I already told you- Did I already tell you that we're gonna do, uh, Jackbox tonight? I don't think I did. If you want to join for Jackbox tonight, you can. We're gonna do more Quiplash, so there's gonna be more foody things going on there. But other than that, you probably will get to enjoy Xenosaga for all the day. <laughs> uh, yeah, I forgot to totally tell you then. I gotta tell everybody, actually. I should probably do that after the stream, then. I'll be like, hey, mate, we're doing, uh... We're doing, uh, Jackbox at this time. So, I thinking... Hmm. Thinking it'll be at, like... 8 or 9 p.m. maybe? <laughs> You're simping for Cosmos. Honestly, that's fair. Yeah. I like me a good robo waifu. Dang. I could have had a full house then. <laughs> Man, how come I can't have good luck like this always? Bro, I hate when the game just gives me my cards back. So mid. <laughs> it's, it's, it might as well just not even have the hit button if you're just gonna give me my cards back, bro. Yeah. Whoa! Wow, he actually made it to the 40s again. Never thought we'd make it back there. Yeah. That's some crazy shit right there. Some crazy shite. And then you give me something worse than a Luigi. You give me a cloud. Wow. Yeah. That's a crazy one right there. Crazy two pair. B tiggle biddies, as they say. <laughs> yeah. Hold on, I gotta. There's a possibility. Yes, four of a kind, baby. Finally, Luigi's instant full house didn't dick me over. I finally done. I've beaten his instant full house. Wow, that feels good. My win streak is going crazy right now. Anyways, I have no idea if I'm gonna do anything in the afternoon. At this rate, I should probably just focus on, uh... I should probably focus on making, like, thumbnails and descriptions and stuff. That's probably what I should do. Because... Aaron's gonna be playing P5R at some point today. Which is good, because he's getting really close to finishing Maruki's Palace. Can't wait to see more of that. Like, I think it'll probably take him, like, two more streams to beat it or something. <laughs> and you're gonna talk about Cosmos this month. I see no issues with that. She's basically the new Igus. Or the older Igus. Wink, wink. Well, I got the worst possible match. <laughs> I mean, the only thing worse than a cloud is junk. Yeah. I mean, I, I realize she existed earlier than I guess, but whatever. Oh, two Luigi's. That might help you out. No. No. Yeah. Anyways, it looks like me and Zeppi are going to be playing Mario Wonder at some point. I don't know when. Maybe this month? Possibly? <laughs> there is SMT, yeah. SMT existed first. Lol. Got him. It's gonna be a busy month. I can already tell. It's like, uh... It's like Reimu says. Looks like this is gonna be a long night. <laughs> Yeah. 
Oh, come on, that's gotta be a good hand, man. Hand man, yes! Good old Persona 1. I might get to play that. I might get to play that game next year. I think it's just kind of, um, I think it's just kind of a trend at this point that I play Persona games in, like, January or February at the start of a year. I always make silly traditions like that. Ooh, another four of a kind. Yeah, Lou, you can't beat that, Luigi. You can't beat my four of a kind flowers. Uh, gotta love, gotta love release dates. Yeah. Two Luigi's. Does that mean I could have had a three of a kind or a full house? I remember as a kid, I always tried to get a flush and I never did. Holy shit, look at this. Damn it, Luigi. I could have had a, my first flush. It's for research purposes. Wow, he just gave me that four of a kind. Maybe that's maybe he's not cheating after all. Yeah. Okay, I'll gladly take a three of a kind. That's a go. That's always good to see. That's for sure. I do like me some research purposes. I need to think about what other games I want to play this year. So I'm still thinking. Mm. I mean, obviously, we're going to play Tomodachi Life this month. That's guaranteed. I just have to finish up Luigi's Casino first. Toho 8 will probably happen alongside... Um, Oh yeah, Silent Hill 2, that's gonna happen, so... That's an October game. And... In terms of other October games... Uh, probably Resident Evil 6. Me and Desmond might actually play Resident Evil 6, because he has that game. Oh shit, four Luigis! Beat that, Luigi. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, oh yeah. Like, I, I think I'm pretty much just gonna do, like, the same three kinds of games every October. <laughs> I was like, I don't know when I'm gonna play Battle for Bikini Bottom. I've just not been in the mood for it. I don't know why. Like, I do want to do it someday. I just don't know when. I have so many other games I want to get to. It's not because I'm lazy, it's just because I want to play other games. I prioritize other shit. Ooh, I like that. Yes! This is the best gambling streak I've had. <laughs> I gave up. Yeah, apparently I also gave up on deciding what games I'm gonna play this year. Well... I'll see how free I am in the summer, because I don't know how free I am in the summer yet. Because at some point during summertime, I want to go, uh... If I have enough money, I want to go visit my dad. Problem is, is he lives all the way back in BC, so I have to get a flight to that. There is Radiant Dawn, yeah. That is going to be a June game. Um... I mean, we're still going to be doing Pokemon Black and White Randomizer. That's going to keep going. Obviously. That would have been the perfect time to get a full house, bruh. I could have had a Mar- I could have three Marios and beat Luigi's instant full house again. Well, either way, it looks like we're going to be doing Mario Wonder and Radiant Dawn. 
at some point in the next two months. Over the summertime? I'm not sure, because the summer is going to have a lot of good games. I want to play Lisa the Painful over the summer. I need to get it still, though. Anyways, what's funny? Damn it, why'd you give me my Mario back? Bruh. How he's just back there with his funny drinks. He never ends up serving those drinks, though. Those drinks don't get served. You're running out of games you want to play. Damn, that's kind of crazy. Come on, man. I could have won that one if I just got on a one pair. I'll always have games I want to play. I mean, I have an entire bucket list. What else was I gonna play this summer? Yeah. See, I completely lost track of my games to play this year. Hmm. Crazy. Yeah. Wow, I barely won that one. Yeah. They don't look like they'll pique your interest, huh? Um, I mean, if there's, if the, like, I make, I think of Mario games that I want to play, because they usually there's a lot of good Mario games. I want to play, I want to play Mario 3 Mix with Mario. <laughs> That's something we might actually end up doing, because it sounds like fun. Damn it. Good old story-driven games. blanking on what games I want to play. I mean, obviously, I'm going to play TTYD Remake. That's going to be, like, near the end of May. So, that honestly, that might be my June game. That's going to be one of my June games, is TTYD Remake, because, uh... Well, it might be a May game, too, because it comes out near the end of May. So, I don't know. Maybe if I can finally play Ninja Gaiden... You know what, that would be a great idea, actually. I could play Ninja Gaiden, because I still have that on my, uh, my Steam page. I still got that on Steam, I haven't played it yet. Well, because, um, I've played, you know, four of the six Devil May Cry games already. So I'm kind of running out of Devil May Cry games to play. The only games I have left to play are DMC Devil May Cry and Devil May Cry 5. And I'm probably gonna play those on... I'm probably gonna play DMC5 on uh, PS4. Or not PS4, uh, yeah. my Xbox Series X, because... I honestly don't know if my PC could handle DMC5. <laughs> DMC, they May Cry, is a maybe. We might be able to run that. Lol. I mean, I'm just thinking about, like, what games I have on my Steam list that I need to play still. You know what, let me open my Steam and then I'll have a look. Damn. I lost so hard. Well, let's see. Um, oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna play... I was gonna play Great Ace Attorney 2 this year. That's another game. Needs a great story, great music, good characters, the setting, and the good gameplay. Well, uh, that's definitely possible, but good luck finding all that. Okay, but if I'm looking at what games I have left to play on my Steam, it'd be Great Ace Attorney 2, um, Metal Gear, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, the Ninja Gaiden Trilogy. Um, maybe one of these Sonic games that Jose gave me, like Sonic uh, Generations, maybe. One of those, maybe, could work. Damn. 
Damn. Damn. I mean, there's certainly stuff for me to play. I don't download a game unless I actually know I'm gonna play it, though. You might be asking for too much, but I won't say it's impossible to find something like that. Otherwise, Jose, you could just play Toho 9. <laughs> That's always an option. Or play, uh, or play one of the fighting games. Play, like, Toho Scarlet Weather Rhapsody. Because apparently that one's really good, and that one has Tenchi in it, so it's automatically good in my book. Three Marios! Yeah, hold that thought. About to get the shittiest full house of all time. Never mind. About to get the shittiest two pairs of all time. Luigi's cheating! This guy's fucking cheating, bro. Well, I asked Dominic if he was free today. He said no, he's doing a tournament. So, it looks like I'm a lot more free today because of that. Well, I, I had an idea, right? I was I told him, like, hey, I have an idea for Friday if you're free and you got your PC. And I said, we should play Tekken 1 on the PlayStation 1. Because I know he likes Tekken, so what if we played the very first Tekken game, just for shits and giggles? And maybe... Maybe we will still do that, just maybe not this week, because... Honestly, me and Dominic have been running out of shit to play for a long time. But, if we could play through all the Tekken games on stream, that would be lit. You gotta find a game, you gotta find a game, mate. Oh, yes. Oh, God damn it! My two Marios and two Luigis got beaten out by three clouds again. All right, who would win? Two Marios and two Luigis or three cloud strifes? That sounds like a really bad Smash matchup. <laughs> well, if Zeno, well, there you go. Zeno gears best. Well, we'll see how long that phase lasts for, because you had your Persona 2 phase. So now you're just- now you're in your Xeno Gears phase. Mario! Luigi's yeah. cheating again, bruh, I tell you. Yeah. Well, we'll see if it lasts a lifetime, because that would be neat. Yeah, now how's it feel? I only have two clouds. See, now two cloud strifes, I could be I could beat that, but three cloud strifes, that's a bit more demanding. It's like the fucking million tigers or whatever, or no, the million lions thing. <laughs> no game can beat Xeno Gears, huh? Yeah, I don't really know what's the best game I've ever played. I mean, Metal Gear Solid 2 is definitely up there for me. And Eternal Punishment. Those are both excellent. TTYD is, my, of course, my all-time favorite. I'm just thinking more in, like, what's 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 a game that I really loved in recent years? Uh, maybe Bug Fables. I loved Bug Fables a lot. It's kind of crazy to believe it's been... Almost a year and a half since I played Bug Fables. Yeah. Like, seriously, I, well, that wasn't very long ago. Yeah, it also feels like it's been a long time. Oh no. Oh no! 
And I'll see if- I'll see how I feel when I play the TTYD remake. I really hope TTYD Remake doesn't suffer from Twin Snake Syndrome. Where the game looks nicer, but it plays way worse. <laughs> I don't think so, because we already know that TTYD is gonna let you pick the original soundtrack, which is already a great sign. You like FE4. I'm guessing that's Geology of the Holy War, right? Fair enough. Yes! I won the one pair MU. Is it- it's possible to be a Fire Emblem fan and never play the games yourself, right? Because I honestly prefer watching you guys play FE instead of me playing it myself. Well, that- no beating that. The best full house in the game. I mean, like, yeah, I love I love Path of Radiance and Engage now, just because I watched you guys play it. The good times. It's about the friends we made along the way. Yeah. And well, apparently Radiant Dawn's better, so I might like that one even more, honestly. Yeah, I won the MU, let's go. playing out my ear a whole lot, did I? I mean, at some point, I want to play Virtual Boy Wario Land. I might play that yeah. next year, though. Um, Luigi's Mansion 2 is also coming out, eventually. I would like to make that an October game, because in October, that's when I play all the, the spooky games. I could play Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon Remake. Yeah. Um, I want to play, um, I think the next... Castlevania game is Portrait of Ruin. I'm obviously gonna play that. And then after Portrait of Ruin would be would come Order of Ecclesia. And then I would be done the uh the all the handheld Fire Emblem or not Fire Emblem. <laughs> all the handheld Castlevania games. And then it would be time to move on to stuff like um Lament of Innocence and stuff like that. Or um maybe Rondo of Blood. Possibly. Yeah, game- it's interesting when games don't age well, but they have amazing stories. I think Persona 2 is a good example of that. I think the gameplay is okay, at best, in that game, but story's top tier. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if I'm gonna get to play Dark Moon Remake. I'll see if I can afford it. Because right now I'm in a real money pinch, which really sucks. Ooh, okay. I'll take that. I mean, Persona 2 is great, and Persona 3 Reload I found really awesome. It's just some of the story beats didn't hit quite the same as they did in the original. But man, is the gameplay and the graphics so much better. Like, if you ask me, I think Persona 3 FES's story is better than Reload in a lot of cases. But Reload looks better and plays better. So it has that going for it. Yeah. Mario is here. Wait, hang on. Mario here. Oh, yo, four Luigis. I'm goaded. Alright, beat that, Luigi. Yeah, that's what I thought. Mm. 
<laughs> oh, who is this git? Upload, leave my eyes alone eight. I can't wait to watch that. I can't wait to kill my eyes. Persona 2 remake. Honestly, the thing I'd be excited about most for a Persona 2 remake, I get to see Akichi in HD. That's the best thing. <laughs> Getting to see my boy in HD, that'd be great. Fuck. Fuck. See everybody in 3D. We can finally get a HD model of Maya. Because the closest thing we had to a Maya model was that unused one in Nocturne. Or was that Lisa? I don't know, I think- I'm pretty sure Maya had like an unused 3D model for Nocturne or something. Okay, it, it was Lisa. Well, either way, that's the closest we've had. <laughs> And it's not even used. <laughs> Come on, Linguini, you gotta play nice today. You were playing nice earlier, play nice now. I, I've seen that fan-made model of Maya. I forgot where I saw it, but it looked pretty damn good. YouTube. YouTube poop. Where there's smoke, there's Luigi getting a full of a kind. Or full of a kind. A full house and dicking me over. YouTube sure is a wonderful place when they're not giving you community guideline strikes for nothing you did. I mean, my recommendations are that probably not that bad. I don't get weird kitty stuff and weird, um, like other weird recommendations 99% of the time. Yeah, screw uploading on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. All right, what else we got? Holy shit! Holy shit, dude! They gave me a full house. Yeah, I hate when YouTube recommends me bullshit that doesn't relate to what I watch. It's even worse when YouTube recommends me cringe content for like the millionth time and I just said, no, I don't want to see this content. Stop recommending it to me. <laughs> like how many times do I have to tell you, YouTube, I don't want to watch cringe? Yes. Cringe, aka spoon. I don't want to see that shit. I'm tired of seeing it. I put that on the soundboard <laughs> it's just him saying i'm tired of seeing it oh, check this out hold up um did, did my uh obs being a little stupid today why isn't it detecting hey look it's honey pop guys where the fuck is Discord? <laughs> I don't know, it's not- it's not- it's not, um... It's not showing my Discord, what the fuck? There. <laughs> that, that is a funny gif. Yeah. Re friendly reminder that I was supposed to play Honey Pop yesterday. But we had problems, and I couldn't wa and I couldn't play it. 
Now you may be like Mr. Van Driesen saying, Now, now, why are you playing Honey Pop? I lost a bet, okay? I'm playing it because I, I lost a bet. <laughs> and the bet was that if Seb beats Honey Pop 1, I have to play Honey Pop 2. Cosmos malfunctions because she detected cringe. You know what that reminds me of? Do I have this old ass image still? Um, I think I found it. This is an old ass meme. This is from 2019. It says, "Bro, you just posted cringe. You're going to lose subscriber." <laughs> That is such an old ass meme now. That's from like five or six years ago. <laughs> but it's so funny. Yeah. Wrong button. Oh, no. Yeah, it's it's not even spelled correctly. It says loose subscriber. <laughs> That's what makes that meme so funny. Who didn't me? Oh, no. See, this is why I'm glad I kept my old memes. Yes, Boonie. I kept my old memes, because now I can look back on the memes that I had like five or six years ago and say like, oh yeah, I remember that shit. That shit was funny. Boonie. And I'm probably going to keep all of my old memes, because they honestly don't take up too much hard drive space. Oh, well, I'm keeping that. That's another book for Mario. Do I have that on the sound? I don't have that on the soundboard either. I don't think I have that as an MP3. Can I find it on YouTube? Um, nope, I can't find it. If I look up another book for Mario, if it, it pops up on, um, it, looks, it pops up Book of Mario instead. <laughs> yes, we're gambling early this morning because I'm bored. We find Sexy Boonie. I do like Sexy Boonie. so bored. Actually, if anything, Luke was sounding like Yuffie yesterday. He says, like, man, I'm so bored. And I was about to say he's Yuffie. <laughs> Stop posting about Among Us. <laughs> Stop posting about Among Us! <laughs> You know what, I'm gonna fucking download that too, because that shit's also funny. I'm tired of seeing it! Why isn't my MP3 downloader working now? What the F, mate? Okay, there we go. Just gonna- just gonna download that real quick. You should add the whole thing. <laughs> no, I was just gonna add the part where he says, I'm tired of seeing it! Oh shit, I forgot to bet my mini. Did I download it yet? Okay, there it is. Yo, three of a kind, baby! Yeah, take that, Linguini. Dude, we are absolutely gonna get to 8k today. This is Pog. Like, I've had such good RNG today. Look at that, look at that, I got it again. Stop posting about Among Us. Oh yeah, I also have the Wario ass video now. <laughs> what if I just have that in like the memory? Hang on.
Can I find the advanced audio properties? I want to I want to hear it. I want to hear it from out here. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> You're becoming the guy who plays Mario Frustration. <laughs> should add the full thing. Dang it. Stop posting about a monk. About a monk. My. My. Hey, what's up? What's up, Zep? Zep? I'm gonna just kind of call it Stop Among Us. There you go. Perfect. Oh, yes! Alright, let's see if I can add that to the soundboard. That'd be pretty funny. I'll put it in meme voices. There you go. Alright, so now we're gonna go to the soundboard and we're gonna add that. Should have added this sooner to be honest, but whatever. Do I have eight A already? Great ether! Oh yeah, it's great ether. Um P. Eight P. I do not have eight P. You know what? We'll do that then. Well, let's find out if my set. Let's see, find out if my soundboard breaks first. Yes, it did. I fucking called it. It fucking broke again. Why does it always do that? I just want to add a damn sound effect, and it just kills itself. Great. Now I have to fucking reopen it. It's not like I'm trying to break it either. It just does it. It just does it for no reason. <laughs> oh no, our table! Look, I just want to add a fucking key. There we go. I'm gonna call it Stop Posting About Among Us. Oh, the instant full house again. Fuck. Yeah. What if I just play the, 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 hat, the first part of it? Stop! Stop! Wow, my soundboard's gone a whole lot better. Wait, hang on. There we go. Yes, I got a three of a kind. No, I lost. Ooh, three linguinis. Are we going 100% Mario Wonder? Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. <laughs> What do you mean, damn it? Is it hard to 100% or something? Yeah. Ooh, a full house. <laughs> You're supposed to fund me, did. Yeah. I mean, it's alright, like... 
If more episodes count as hard, then yes. Oh. Bro, I always 100% every Mario game I play. It's a tradition. It's a 10 second video. Well, let's see what we got. We got- it's from Edelgard. Hold on. <laughs> Dear Professor, do not come to the monastery. I've baked an absolute dog shit cake. Just completely fucked it up. I'm so sorry. Edelgard. <laughs> wow, thank- thanks, Bredelgard. Red Olgar. Also, look, guy, we had seven, 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 seven coins. It's it's my lucky day. Oh yeah, Giga Chad Koopa just went up on YouTube today. Yeah. We gotta do the final, final badge Kaizo ass level. Okay, I don't know if I, I don't know if we'll beat that, but we'll see. We'll try. <laughs> I never beat Champions Road, legitimately. And I never beat, um, the final level in Mario Odyssey legitimately, either. So, yeah. The only one of those, like, ball-breaking levels I've ever beaten was, uh, the perfect run. That's the only one I've actually ever done. It's like, it's like what I said yesterday, it's like dragging your ball sack through a cheese grater. I know I didn't say that. I didn't say that yesterday. I said it's like dra dragging your ball sack through a mouse trap. <laughs> the last badge is a pain in the ass. Hmm. I mean, I know there's some bullshit in Mario Odyssey, like invisible crap. There's like invisible crap they have to find or something. I don't know. I haven't really watched the video. I don't. I try not to watch videos on games I've never played. Like. Um, I don't know. Like, whenever Copycat gets to the Mario Wonder segments of his videos, I usually just, like, stop watching the video, or I just, like, go A. I just, like, don't look at the video. Well, good on you for finishing Champions Road. You're probably, you, you know what you probably did, Jose? You probably beat it five times with all the characters, didn't you? <laughs> that seems like something you'd do. Uh, did I actually call it? I actually called it. <laughs> well, I mean, if you did it the first time, it's probably easy the other four times. Ooh, I see three mushrooms. Damn it. I mean, I've done Champions Road a bunch, a bunch of times too. I actually almost beat it. I got to the last section where there's just a shit ton of boost panels and there's keys everywhere and Cody's. I got to that part. That's as far as I got. And then I just said like, nah, fuck that. I'm not doing that again. I just, I got, I didn't ever hit to finish it. Like that's literally the last section of the level. And I think I was missing like one of the keys. I died, and I said, nah, fuck that. I got as far as I can. I'm just gonna stop. <laughs> so, I mean, I pretty much beat Champions Road. It's just I didn't get the last key and see the end of the level. Well, people always, people, people always say, like, hey, when are you gonna do 3D World? And uh, that's something me and my girlfriend are gonna do someday, so that's kind of like a reserve game, so that's why I'm not playing with anybody. Because, yes, I get bugged about that on, like, a monthly basis, probably. Because <laughs> that was one of her favorite... That's one of her favorite games, and I wouldn't want to take it away from her. So, hopefully that's understandable. Ooh, full house. Yeah, no instant full house for you this time, Luigi. I'm the one with the instant full house. But yeah, 3D World's cool. I played it as a kid. I liked it. I pretty much 100%ed it. The only thing I didn't do was beat the final levels. Like, I didn't beat Champions Road or the final Mystery House. And I didn't, um... 
I didn't get all the stamps, because I didn't get the, the five that you need for playing every level with every character. I didn't get that either, because that's a pain in the ass. <laughs> It's just, that's just tedious. I don't like to count the stamps towards 100%. Is, as far as I'm concerned, getting all the green stars and all the stamps, like, all the stamp collectibles are good enough for me. And all the gold flagpoles. I'm good enough with that, honestly. <laughs> Sometimes, I just disregard what the game would consider 100%, and I just make my own, oh my god, Luigi's cheating again. Sometimes I just make my own 100% criteria. It's like, if I did everything that I think is good enough, I will just consider that. Like, I think Wario Land 3 was a good example of that. Like, I never did all the time attacks on all the levels. Because I think getting... I, I think if I wanted to truly 100% Wario Land 3, I would have had to do time attack on every level and beat the time. But I just said, nah, fuck that. I've played Wario Land 3 for long enough. I'm just going to not do that. You repeated to finish all the levels. That is pretty, uh, that is pretty crazy. Yeah. Luigi, bro, stop cheating. The head dedication. If I can get to 8k, I'll probably stop. But I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how far I can get. Because, uh, I've been going for 52 minutes already. Stop cheating, Luigi! I get a full house and you ruin it, asshole. My perfect win, bro. Had dedication? That still doesn't make sense. Oh yeah, apparently there's a there's a very bad bug going around right now on Windows 11 computers. Uh, more reasons not to upgrade to Win or more reasons not to downgrade to Windows 11, guys. Apparently, Windows 11 it fucks up your VPN. And apparently, Windows doesn't know how to fix it. So uh, yeah, Windows 11 sucks. No surprise there. If you didn't have enough reasons to say Windows 11's shit, well, there's another reason for you. I will die on this hill and stay on Windows 10 as long as humanly possible. I'm sure that's how people felt about Windows 7 back in the day, because Windows 8 is garbage. And I would know, because I had to use Windows 8 for a long time, because my laptop came pre-installed with it. I, actually, I don't think I've ever been on Windows 7. I was on Windows Vista. I had a, I had Vista back on an old-ass PC. <laughs> and nobody knows what happened with Windows 9, either. But I was on Vista, and Vista was alright, honestly. <laughs> I mean, it's alright, like... I quite liked Vista. I was able to run some... I was, I was able to run uh, Mario Bros. X on that thing. I got, I got a lot of work done on that thing. And I don't know if Windows Vista is any good. I'm pretty sure it was kind of mid. I think XP was the better one, but... I mean, whatever. That's the oldest Windows that I remember using. 3 Mario's! Mario's got three lives, baby.
Yeah, apparently, like, Windows 10 is, like, kind of on par with Windows 7. So, yeah, pretty good. Wow, good thing I got stars, because if I didn't get stars, I would have lost that. Actually, you know what? Maybe I'll stop at 7,900. Mario Wonder has a shop in the special where you can buy standees for the ones you missed. Interesting. Sorry, I was just having a coughing fit for whatever reason. Mario wonders why he has a theme park. Okay, you know what? I changed my mind. I will go to 8K. Because I still got plenty of time. I mean, I'm not really on a time limit. I just like to usually limit these to around an hour long at a time. But I guess if we do next episode, we can start at 8k. Yeah. And then try and make some progress from there. I mean, yeah, I guess you could say it's a time limit. At least it's not as bad as the old 15-minute time limits that were back in the day. Yeah. Or 10... Actually, well, I know that the, YouTube had like a 10-minute time limit. And then they... I think they extended it to 15 minutes. And then, eventually, they just stopped caring how long your videos are. <laughs> wow, what a lucky win that was. Yeah. It kind of sounds like, um... kind of sounds like Isaac. Like Isaac's voice clips in, uh, Smash, uh, in Trash. Where he has like that low quality ass voice where he's just like, yeah. yeah. Hmm. Come on, Luigi, give me the goods. That's not the goods. That's giving me back my Mario. Yes, from Golden Sun. The Golden Sun Isaac. I have no idea when I'll play Golden Sun, to be honest. But that is a game that's been on my, uh... It's been on my watch list, I guess you could say. That's like, uh, hmm, I might play that game, it sounds interesting. Yeah. Same thing goes for, um... Uh, actually, I don't know. I, was gonna, I don't know what I was gonna say, actually. Maybe Dragon Quest I could play someday, too. I mean, there's just overall a lot of games I could play. So many games, so little time. You're never gonna be able to play all the games you want in one lifetime. Oh, no! Yeah, Golden Sun is on the radar. I mean, it's made by Camelot, the people who made the Mario Sports games, I'm pretty sure. And, uh, Camelot was making peak back in the 2000s. And then Nintendo decided to rush the shit out of them. And now we've had shitty Mario Sports games for the past 10 years. So, yeah. Well, actually... Camelot didn't make Mario Strikers, but Mario Strikers was also shit. I'm assuming Nintendo rushed, um, I think it was level 5? I think that's what they're called. Yeah. I always forget what they're called. It's something like, you know, let me just, let me, let me actually do my facts. Who made Mario Strikers? Oh, it's next level. See, I always get next level games and level five studios mixed up because they both have the word level in it. <laughs> level five are the people who made the fucking Professor Layton games. Ooh, four, four clouds. But yeah, Mario Strikers Charge was goaded.
Well, apparently they're making they're apparently they're making a new Professor Layton game or something. I've heard, or at least they're trying to. Yeah, you did a good job. You're good at gambling. Someday we will have to check out Strikers. If I can get the fucking motion controls to work, that is. Alright, you know what? I think that's a good note to end on. We have 8,016 coins now. Look at that. Yeah, perfect. Perfect number to end on. Alright, so... Yeah. It gets pro it gets progressively tough. Wow, good to know. Anyways, um, thanks guys for watching Luigi's Casino. Okay. Anyways, make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and Twitch, and um, we'll see everybody in the next episode. There might honestly only be two more episodes of this, to be honest, because um. Yeah, like, I think if... It depends how many coins I get in the next episode. Like, if I don't get to 9k in the next episode, we'll make the finale extra long then, so we can get to 10k. So, yeah. I'll see you guys then.